In this video, I'm going to show you how to uh, make the two points that we need to have to make the angles going across on both sides to cut those tabs off, those little ears that we have on our rectangle. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come in with my eraser tool and I'm going to erase the extra guides that I have. Just to clean this up a little bit before I add a few more guides so I know what I'm looking at. Now the next thing is I want to come in and the first one from our bottom edge is one and three fourths up. So I'm going to go in from my tape measure tool, zoom in my part a little bit just to make it a little bit more centered. From the green axis I can use the midpoint just to make sure I have that selected. Slide up, click, and this I'm going to enter data, the data being one space three forward slash four, or one and three fourths. Enter. The next thing I want to do is I want to do the same thing, but now I want to do it from the green axis over here going into my piece. This one is going to be from my data saying 1 and 7 sixteenths. So type me in 1 space 7 forward slash 1 six or 1 and 7 sixteenths. Enter. Now, on the opposite side, our 1 and 3 fourths is the same. But coming in here, our extra one, or the other one starts 3 inches into our piece. So once again, Midpoint, select it. Now I'm going to come in, I'm going to enter three inches. Now I have intersections made in all the locations I need to draw my straight lines from. How I do that is going into here, taking my pencil tool, which is the line tool, selecting the intersection, selecting the intersection, intersection to intersection. And then lastly, eraser tool, click and drag through, click and drag through. Uh, if we know we don't need um, the rest of our guidelines anymore, we can also delete these guidelines. There's no more that need to be in 3 inches, and there's one more that needs to be inch and 7 16, so I'm going to leave that one later on, and then inch and 3 fourths, we don't need any more either. So that's the way I'm going to end my piece. We just got done creating the ears or the tabs that are taken off. Thanks for watching the video. Hope it helps.